are learning to cook pizza journey and today I'm cooking in the pro I'm gonna be cooking a chorizo and mushroom pizza wood-fired let's get this fire started So I've made the pizza. I'm just checking on my. Woohoo! Fire. And I want to see what the temperature is in there. In the middle. It's about. If I just put the pizza about there, then I'm good to go. Don't think I'll wait for it to get any hotter. Make sure it doesn't stick there. Is that sticking? It's sticking there. Right. Right, it's coming off now. Right. It's going in. A bit further down. Oh, it's so hot. It's a hot day and a hot oven. I really do want to cook without my door on. I'm going to see how it goes. It's a lot more interesting with the door off. But then I appreciate that it doesn't give up the pizza as good a, you know, it doesn't cook as fast, but um, I think I prefer it. So I get asked what pizza peel do I use with the Coda and which do I use with the Pro. I use the Uni long handled peel with the Pro and the shorter handled rock box turning peel with the smaller ovens like the Coda and the rock box and the Adore. Thank <laughs> you. 
checking it to see you've got everything covered. Looks pretty good to me. Done. chorizo melted in with the mozzarella and those mushrooms so tasty look at that it's all melted in together i'm gonna try that crispy edge there so i didn't cook with the door on and it did take a bit longer but it was more fun and i prefer to do it that way because i can see the pizza being cooked properly Seven percent hydration dough. It's very crunchy, less leoparding, but it was easier to stretch. I started off with sixty percent, uh, then I went up to seventy percent. Now I've gone to sixty-two percent. But I also thought it would be a good idea to try the fifty-seven percent, and I'm happy with that as well. And I think if you're new to pizza dough and you're new to stretching, fifty-seven percent is a it's nice. It's a nice dough to use. So it was a fridge proof, then straight into the freezer, and then a room proof, very warm room proof. Actually, I put it outside, and it's 25 degrees outside, so it just defrosted and proofed, and this is what how it came out. And I do like that base, so it's very tasty. This was an 11 inch pizza, but I think it shrunk down to a 10 by the time I'd finished cooking, but it's very nice. Take care, everyone. Bye. And don't forget to check out our website, gottoeatpizza.com. Link is below. Mm -hmm.